Hey guys, I'm back again for another uh, quick video, actually. Um, had a, uh, one of my recent subscribers, he goes by uh, Brain Rot, I'll leave his link below, uh, had watched my Top 10 Giallos video and uh, <clears throat> requested that I do a uh, my Top 10 Favorite Horror Films of All Time video. Now, sadly, I couldn't decide on a top uh, ten list, but my top five favorite horror films of all time are pretty well set. Uh, so I thought I'd just knock out this video real quick for everybody and, uh, you know, see what everybody else thinks about it. So, at number five... I had to go with Bad Taste, uh, Peter Jackson's first film. It's kind of a gore comedy. I've seen this movie hundreds and hundreds of times. I, I love this movie. Um, it's just hilarious. Uh, Peter Jackson actually not only directs it, but stars in it. And it's my favorite Peter Jackson film of all time as well. So. Anyone that hasn't actually seen this yet, I, I would recommend it highly to go check it out. It's really funny, it's really gory, it's, it's, it's spoofy, it's low budget, but in a really fun way. So, that's my number five of all time, Bad Taste. At number four is Ruggiero Deodato's classic jungle cannibal film. I love uh, Italian jungle cannibal films and this is definitely my favorite one. Um, it's of course Cannibal Holocaust. Not too much to say about this. Everybody's seen this already. Uh, this is the Grindhouse releasing deluxe edition. It's got quite a, quite a bit of uh, bonus material on it and so on. Um, I think there's other better versions of this film out right now, but for now this one will do. Um, anyway, great, uh, great movie, a great, uh, you know, musical score by uh, Riz Ortolani. Uh, probably my favorite, favorite or second favorite uh, musical score to a film of all time. So anyway, guys, that's Cannibal Holocaust at number four. My number three horror film of all time has got to be Dario Argento's Suspiria. Uh, to me, one of the, uh, probably the best uh, sort of uh, witch movie of all time. Uh, and, and possibly my favorite score ever by the uh, uh, prog rock group uh, Goblin. Um, I don't know, to me just some fantastic atmosphere, some fantastic uh, uh, settings, his use of color and so on in the film is just fantastic. Really suspenseful movie and it's definitely my favorite Italian film of all time. So at number three it's Suspiria. At number two is George A. Romero's 1985 classic, Day of the Dead. This is the old Anchor Bay uh, edition. It kind of opens up like so. Pretty cool. I've had this for 10, 11, 12 years, something like that. And then I've shown this off before. This is, of course, the brand new Blu-ray uh, by Scream Factory. Really awesome transfer. I still haven't changed the art, but I just haven't had time to mess with nothing lately. So that's, of course, the Scream Factory edition. I mean, what can I say about this fantastic zombie movie? Um, probably my favorite gore effects in a zombie film were in this movie. And it's just, just a pinch, guys, away from being my number one uh, horror film of all time. And that leaves at number one, and I've done a video where I've discussed this before, actually. It's George A. Romero's Dawn of the Dead. Uh, you know, it's a little 
bit earlier films. Of course, the special effects aren't quite as cool. Uh, this is the Ultimate Edition DVD that has three cuts of the film. Um, and then, of course, as I also showed in another video already, I have the Arrow Region 3 Blu-ray. And again, what can you say about it? I love the mall setting. I love the uh, sort of consumerism sort of angle and spin he puts on this. I love the characters. I just, I love the story. I love everything about it. It's my favorite uh, zombie film and in this case also my favorite horror film of all time. So anyway guys, I will, uh, that will pretty much wrap it up for me. Um, and uh, I'll catch you guys uh, later.